Jack Sneedon joins us after Atlantic's big 17-point win over St. Albert. Just first of all, how big is this for you guys? Where you're at, you're three and four as a team before tonight. Yes, played really good on Monday, but didn't get rewarded. To go into you know 12 days off, how crucial of a win is this for your confidence um, as a group? It was big. It was big. Uh, we went into break last year on a loss, and you know that was an awful winning break for us. But this year it's a little different. We went on a win, a good win. So. Um, they gave us confidence as well, you know. To begin the season, we were all kind of timid and shy, and now we're all kind of a little more confident. So. What about winning by the margin you did too? This is not a team that really ever gets blown out or gets held below 50. What do you think that means for you guys to win in such a dominant fashion? Uh, it means that our defense held them to a low number of points. So our defense was what anchored our win tonight, and then our offense is uh, we shot the ball well, we hit free throws, and Got the ball to Scott. How about uh, Austin the second half? He had finished with, I think, 19, didn't have any at halftime. Did you sort of, because I sort of sense he sort of had a look in his eye in the second half that he was just going to be a yeah, stone uh, cold killer. Yeah, uh, Coach told him at halftime that he needed to go and attack. That's what he did. Uh, you know, he's, a, he's our go to guy. He's, he's a playmaker for us. Uh, he and Scott, you know, they're, St. Albert's a group that has a couple posts that can kind of match up with him, but he. Now, of course, the Fagan kid got two quick fouls, but he absolutely dominated down low. It's got to be a lot easier for you guys when he's having a game like that also. Yeah, no one can guard Scott in the conference. Uh, I think that's been seen. So uh, that's why we uh, our offense moves through Scott, because uh, that's our clear advantage. I think this is sort of an eye-opener for maybe the rest of the conference that you guys needed to send a message that, hey, you know, maybe you forgot about us, but we're still we're still here. Yeah, I think uh, teams are going to be a little more uh, scared to scout us and a little more uh, probably circle our name on the schedule a little more often. Thanks, Jackson. Merry Christmas.